Hey guys, Beautiful 404 here, and today I'm making a video on how to access the UEFI BIOS on uh, on Windows 10. And if this doesn't work on all computers, I know for a fact that it works on HP because that is the computer I'm using right now. So to get started, we are going to go to the Start menu and click Power. And as we are pressing the Restart button we are going to press and hold the shift key so three two one and you can press it before you click restart so it'll say please wait instead of restarting I just like to hold it because we never know I just continue to hold it until you see a menu similar to this come up. So to get your uh, to your BIOS from here, you're going to click Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, UEFI Firmware Settings. Now this might be slightly different on your computer, but this is what it looks like on HP. And then Restart. So now on HP, this is what it looks like when you uh, get to your startup menu. So F1 is for system information. F2 is for system diagnostics. F9 is for boot device options. F10 is for BIOS setup. And F11 is for system recovery. So we want to go to BIOS setup. So we will press F10 on the keyboard. And here we are. So you now have the setup utility. And from here, you can set system time and date, system log, um, very, very simple. Uh, you have your security, so your administration password and your power on password. Your system configuration, so you have language, virtualization technology, fan always on, which I like to turn on just to keep my um, computer a bit cooler, and action keys mode, which I will have a video on on how to activate and disable later, um, probably on f Monday, and I will show you what the action keys are and what they do, and then you have boot options, so what you want, what you wish to boot to, so CD-ROM boot, which is what my o OS is on, you can have, yeah, you can have any, you have access over your entire computer, and to go back, you just press the escape key. And then once you are done, uh, you can click exit while saving changes, press enter, and then enter. And your computer should restart. And you'll be good. And we're booted, so thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to leave a like on the video if you liked it, dislike if you didn't like it, but who wouldn't like a video like this? Uh, remember to comment if you want more tech tips, uh, quick tech tips like this. And uh, yeah, see you guys later. Peeps0404 out. Peace.